If you're into wholesaling and flipping, then you know how important it is to have as many different ways as possible to find discounted properties. Well, in this video, I'm gonna show you how to find cheap houses to wholesale in minutes using a simple search on redfin.com. Coming up. This video is brought to you by Flipster, the nation's number one real estate software with tools for finding, funding, and flipping houses. Check it out now at getflipster.com. If you're new here to this channel, I'm Jerry Norton with FlippingMastery.com, and this channel is all about ways to help you make money wholesaling and flipping real estate so you can live your dream life. Be sure to subscribe and click the bell icon to get notified when new videos are released. As a real estate investor and especially a wholesaler and a flipper, you need to become intimately aware of how to use the four big free online real estate service websites. They are starting with the most visited to least visited, Zillow.com, Trulia.com, which Zillow acquired back in 2015, Realtor.com, and then finally, redfin.com. Now, among other things, these are real estate information sites, not just for finding homes for sale, which we'll talk about in a minute, but also to find sold home data to help determine home values, as well as other valuable market research. Now, if you're a subscriber to my channel and you watch my videos, you'll see I often use these sites to help me with wholesaling and flipping, especially redfin.com, which is my favorite of the four big sites. And on this video, I wanna show you a really cool, simple way to search for cheap houses for sale that you can wholesale or flip on redfin.com. Now, like I said earlier, Redfin is my favorite. I love their user interface and their mapping features. But perhaps what I love most about Redfin is they provide the price per square foot. This is significant because price per square foot allows you to measure values evenly since all homes are different sizes. Now, if you're unfamiliar with how to use price per square foot for comping properties and especially to find underpriced homes, I did a video where I break it down in detail. I'll put the link to that video in the description below for you to watch later. To me, Redfin is the most innovative and they tend to have more investor-friendly tools. Now, the downside is they are not in every market yet. To find out if Redfin is in your market, just go to redfin.com and enter in your zip code to see. But assuming they are, I wanna show you a fairly new filter tool that Redfin added to its search criteria called Fixer Uppers. Now, Redfin defines a fixer upper as a home that can usually be lived in but needs maintenance work, redecoration, redesign, or reconstruction, and is typically offered at a low purchase price. Fixer uppers can be attractive to buyers looking for more house for their money or to investors looking to flip the property to make a profit. Now, it's unclear how Redfin decides if a property fits the fixer upper category. My guess is it looks for keywords in the description, such as TLC, investment property, needs work, handyman, as is, must sell, motivated seller, etc. Words and phrases to let you know it's a distressed property. So let me show you how simple it is to do a search and how to get notified every time a new fixer upper comes available. First, go to redfin.com and enter in your city or zip code. You'll see a map on the left and a list on the right. Make sure for now that you're on the table view. Then click on more filters and under property type, click house, as well as any other search filters that you may have, such as minimum three bedrooms or minimum thousand square feet, whatever criteria you have for deals that you want to search for. Then right here, you'll see fixer uppers only. That's what we're after, checkbox that and then if there aren't any other filters, click apply filters. So on the left is the map of all of the homes that Redfin defines as fixer uppers. On the right is the list. Now before going through and looking at them, I like to click on the price and it will sort from lowest to highest. Or you can also do the same with price per square foot. Now you can either click on the address or click on the property pin on the map and you can scroll through the pictures. If you wanna pull up the listing for more info, just click on the image right here, and then it will open a new window with that property. Now, another cool feature is the favorites feature. So let's say that you really like this deal here. Right here, you can click on the heart, and you'll notice that it puts a heart right here, right here, and even on the map right here. And if you wanna see a list of all of your favorites, just go to the drop down menu and click the favorites tab, and it will pull up a list of all of your favorites that you can manage. So when it comes to on-market properties, some are overpriced and will sit forever until the seller eventually comes down on price. Some are priced too high even though the seller will 
actually entertain your low offer if you would just be willing to make it. And some properties are priced really aggressively right from the get-go and sell fast. Regardless of the situation, you wanna know as soon as new listings come out. So let me show you how simple that is with Redfin's Save Search feature. All you do is right here, click Save Search. Now, if you haven't set up a free account, you'll need to do that first. Name your search, your city or zip code slash fixer uppers. Then choose how often to be notified when new listings come out. Now, I recommend you choose instantly so that you get notified right away when a new listing comes out. That's it. Now, as soon as a new fixer upper property comes out for sale, you'll get an email notification. Now, most people don't know this, but you can actually wholesale on market properties just like you can with off market properties. I did a video where I show you how. I'll put a link to that video in the description below and you can watch it later. And to help you really go after on market deals in a big way, be sure to get my free software that instantly gives you a list of all of the underpriced properties in any zip code real time. Like I said, it's free. Just go to mydatacruncher.com. Hey, and if you learned something new in this video, do me a favor and hit that like button and leave a comment and let me know if you plan on going after these Redfin Fixer Upper properties. And if you haven't yet, be sure to subscribe to my channel with hundreds of videos here on the channel and new videos released every single week. This is the number one channel on YouTube for all things wholesaling and flipping. And don't forget, it's not about the money, it's about having the time and freedom to have, be, do, and give everything God has in store for you. That's what it's all about, and I'll see you on the next video.